Hello, Martians and architects of space. Resources Welcome are back to Surviving Mars and playing hardball. And our wonderful, beautiful, little and growing colony over here. So we have less problems with our services and hopefully the living quality of people is increasing now. Especially as another 12 settlers are coming in. However, I think you might want to start thinking about uh, more habitation for our children as well, right? That might be a thing. Although our school, uh, can children go at to school at night? Oh my goodness. Well then, a night shift for children. <laughs> That's a thing, right? So, well. So, and well, we do have this renegade. Yeah, and by the way, maybe we should put the renegade here. And she's here. That's Johanna Vogel. Let's hope she doesn't die. Here she. Chantal. That's Chantal. She's stressed out. Yeah, well, actually, well, I hope... I hope that she is... Uh, no, she's a geologist. Why is she... It doesn't say that she's a renegade. Ah, this one. Johanna Vogel is the renegade. Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay, well, actually, that's possibly a bad thing. Also, in, uh, in this uh, dome, we don't have the security. Well, okay, but I, I guess we'll find out what's happening, what's going to happen, and then we'll see. So what's the situation here? Alien imprints, okay, 67%. That will be interesting that will be interesting so up here where we can only wait that things will develop further our drones have ev everything under control over here we have enough stuff yeah it's all it's all it's fine these guys can put uh, this guy can put the metal there and then actually where's our other transport this one it's full so let's bring the stuff here yeah let's bring it there everything please And I actually, I really want to have the meteor defense system now because our polymers are kind of, but well it's, uh, you know, it's getting lower and lower. So we need to do a little bit on that side. There are still no people working here. Oh, by the way, we could even have a night shift here. Oh, and we are at 19. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, yeah, and this one. Hardball rocket. Yeah, I guess we have 3.4 billion uh, dollars. <coughs> let's... Uh, yeah, let's return it to Earth. Huh? And we have only a few uh, metals anyway. Let's return to Earth. So what about our tourists, by the way? How's their situation? Are they happy? I mean, the lowest one has 56. George Anton. 
parts morale. Also comfort. Ah yeah, the comfort is great. Oh yeah, okay. Uh, so this one is the comfort. So 51 is the lowest. So what's going on with you? You're a gamer, hippie, sexy and tourist. Yeah, no, Janus. Oh, why are you here? Why are you living in the living complex? Why there, buddy? You need to be here. Okay, someone is supposed to be there. Okay. Well, anyway, so these, these things here, by the way, they are supposed to work, right? This is the art store. You work there. Why is a botanist working there? Ah. This botanist is supposed to be somewhere else, I'm sure. And I have still no idea why they are just moving around like this. <sighs> this is so sad with this game. So you need to work here, please. rather like yeah like this so and then you can actually can you live here or there oh yeah destroy this building we'll just do it like this and then uh, I think this is easier so when they they have the people here yeah I need the diner and everything there's a space bar someone should work there as well okay yeah good Good. The drones should collect the stuff. And then we'll build another apartment block over here. I think. Yeah. Because we have way more potential for scientists here. And we'll have uh, one more. One more shop. Which is where well, we have art store and electronics what else do we need actually we need to wait for the art workshop or this bio robotics workshop or the vr workshop actually ah yeah well okay I think yeah let's have let's have apartments there I think that's better question is can build it over the resources I hope they are not destroying the polymers already uh, there are six polymers so maybe maybe actually that thing oh yeah this looks nice like this yeah very good it already uh, took the, the resources and it's electronics okay good 
and then we'll build another workshop there like this uh, this uh, one workshop and I think that's uh, that's a pretty good thing then all right very good and then we'll build a, a huge dome here another dome and in that dome we'll also have facilities for children I think that's a good thing oh, and we do have a storm coming a dust storm oh yeah nice here this uh, One will touch down there. We have two unemployed colonists. So always put this one uh, in the mode, like not accepting new colonists, right? I also feel like we need uh, we need more drones. Oh yeah, here here are the new settlers. Very good. Yeah, I mean I think we are not we don't need to micromanage this one. Let's just go here. New colonists have arrived. Actually, maybe we do. Maybe we have to. So you are a geologist, you are also a geologist. You are another geologist. No specialization, you are working in the diner, okay. You are homeless and working in the research lab. No specialization. No, what's, what's going on here, why? Ah. Scientist. Ah, that's the thing. So this one was sucking up all the people for the services. That's the thing. Okay, well then let's wait how this how things develop here. Then uh, once this one here is built, I just put the the Olympus Hotel uh, on tour tourists only, and then we we'll push the the other guy back, right? So he can actually live here, because the other guys they have all a very nice high uh, ratio. This will be really good for our colony, I guess. Getting excellent feedbacks from the tourists. So, oh yeah, and by the way, we might want to prioritize this one. So, come on, drones. Do this one as a priority. If you are, if you were so kind. Sector scanned. Oh, lots of metals over here, and even deep space. Okay, up there. Oh, interesting. Okay. That is quite interesting. We have two hundred one rare metal still in the earth. So here we are, and now everything is 
seems to be full, right? So you guys, oh, you have one unemployed and four homeless. Here we have lots of vacant slots, but the homeless people, uh, there's another homeless one. Who's homeless here? Homeless. It's back residents. Who's homeless? Oh, one child is homeless. Uh, that's actually not good. So you live here. So who's unemployed? Ah, he's a geologist. Hmm. Okay, well, actually, well, and why doesn't he work here then? Let's, let's do this one then. She can actually work, uh, live in here. She's working there, that way she has a, a shorter way to work. Yeah, so I, it's it's really weird and sad uh, that this is not automatically g uh, going t uh, in the most efficient way. So, well, anyway, here we are. Then here we have two unemployed people who's unemployed to scientists I oh, know they have no uh, specialization in Schuster okay well then Ernst if all slots are filled then actually it's great that you want to work so you work here please go there and work here uh, live here one and this guy works in the casino please so and that should solve it right There's space for colonists. The child is going to the other side. Oh, yeah. And then here, yeah, like so. Okay, yeah. Five more slots free for people. And then you guys. Uh, are there any seniors? No. No senior citizens. Four homeless. Who's unemployed? Yeah, well, homeless. Well, the gambler could work in the casino, right? And then he's going crazy. But let's do that, actually. You go here and you live in there. So it should, should be a great living co uh, quality for him, right? It doesn't say how many work slots there are actually. But everything is everything is full now. Botanist. she's working uh, she's living there okay so then you you can actually live here go 
world to live in here. Why is she losing her job? So it appears, ah yeah, okay. So it appears that uh, only the the direct co directly connected one is a, uh, is, is a valid choice. Yeah, it's really a weird system. So, and then you need to work here, please. I hope it will regulate itself somehow. So we have four more sp four sp uh, space for more people. So time to for this one. Oh yeah, just one more concrete. One more unit of concrete. Who's bringing it? Come on, little drones. Increase the speed. That comes. Or there. Yep, and now they build it. Very good. Someone sitting there. Well, anyway, so here now we have enough space for everybody. So, you guys, yeah, this one is only for tourists now, so 10 tourists, right? And we do have. Uh, sorry, the entire colony. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so how? Ah, oh yeah, this guy, Justus Weber. Oops. You go and live here, please. That was Justus Weber, and then. These guys, they are all living in the Olympus Hotel. That's good. But there is someone else. One more person there. Ludus Wagner. Ah, yeah. Yeah. You need to move to the Olympus Hotel. I think his specialization as engineer was something that was kind of uh, confusing for me. Okay, but the the uh, the slots are Research now complete. reserved. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, five anomalies found. Oh, up there. Okay. Oh, okay. We do have a strong argument. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's bad. We have a strong argument to do something so we can actually get there. But let's have was our explorer. There. Oh yeah, nice. Okay. Closest one. It's up there. So you go there and scan this anomaly and the alien imprints. So it uncovers new anomalies, alien artifacts, which provide a tech cost reduction to all fields when scanned. So yeah, that's good. So that should be a total priority now.
Yeah, and I guess, yeah, so the defensive system is a good thing now. That's a good thing. And I think the next thing should be something where we can build these other, uh, what could it be? Engineering, I guess. We can wor uh, work. We can build these uh, these other workshops. Is this one a passenger rocket waste rock processor? That's also interesting because we have so much waste rock, right? And I think it was here, right? In physics or something. Research amplification or deep metal extraction, triboelectric tri scrubbing. The water ex ah yeah there the VR workshop and it's for ten people a vocation building that allows colonists to experiment with virtual reality counts towards the workshop miles and consumes electronics. How do you know it's sci-fi? VR is commercially viable, said Shams Yojani. Okay, well maybe we need to know what it is actually before building it but I guess we have to uh, we have to explore it first so uh, this is the art workshop a vocation building that allows colonists to experiment with different forms of art counts towards the workshop milestone and consumes polymers we don't make mistakes just happy little accidents hmm Now, so actually, I think the home collective is better. So all everybody has a higher uh, comfort residential building, right? Although it's pretty expensive. Oh, no, 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 sorry. We need to build the thing. So the people who are living in the Northern Dome uh, can actually do something. So let's have the art workshop. I think that sounds actually nice. So the, the art workshop cost 13,500 well the VR thing was it or where was it I see commander you're there oh no actually yeah then then let's actually do the VR workshop first it costs only 7,000 and then we will actually do this one first after the meteor defense system so it's good. I hope the meteor defense system has a long range and not just like a circle like this. But I guess it's automated. So here we go. Now this dome. There's three unemployed people. Why? So one of the tools has arrived. So I guess we can actually let the others come in now. So yep, there we go. Everyone wants to live in there, of course. So I think that that went well. So this one is the tourists, yeah. And then their comfort. The lowest comfort is 65, Otto Berger. Yeah. He wanted to do a safari and dining. Well, he can go to the dining, right? Whenever he wants now. I think they will be all very happy now. That's a good thing, so. All right. Well then, and here, here we do have this rocket. Well, let's let's keep it here for a moment. 
and actually like what what other missions do we have we only have the the safety satellite we already have one right and the high-speed comps uh, satellite that's oh we, we already did it right where, where do i see it that we had it sponsor genius colonist explorers no actually hmm, where is it maybe we, sh we should make that one a priority now as well so we need more stuff and actually I mean, it will be a while before we have the, the defense system installed, so this rocket can actually go back to Earth as well. So let's fly back to Earth. Let's do it. And then we can keep one rocket at Earth. As a backup. So no one seems to want to work here. No, the casino complex is fine. I wish I could just uh, do it like this then. Just push the guy, like drag and drop the people. That would be so helpful. I find that kind of idyllic that people are sitting on the benches and relax here. I like that. So. Although it was pro probably a little bit overkill, but well, I think. No, you know, it's, people are inside all the time, so it's a good thing. By the way, let's have a look at this here. 11 people have already visited it, and 12 this one, 8 this one this park no one okay interesting no one ever went to the park hmm. well so. so we do have the bar here so things should be good and okay anomaly analyzed oh yeah nice Research cost of all tax reduced. Oh yeah, it's a percentage, three percent. Okay, nice. So this is this is our explorer there. So where's the next alien technology? Oh, will be trade. So two are here, and this is the third one. Were there five? Yeah, okay, so actually that's really bad. We need to get there. So I guess we need to build something. No. We need to build something. We can't get over here. Yeah, sorry. So we will we are going to flatten this one here so we can get there. I, I actually, I wanted to have as little impact on uh, the Martian landscape. But uh, it's better to flatten it here because there are two of them rather than uh, building another tunnel because the tunnel is really expensive. Okay then, so drone commander, you are here. We don't need you there actually. So you drive there with your drones. We call all drones. And then we'll start the project, get the anomalies, this one here, and then we drive there. Yeah, so. So this one was the first alien anomaly uh, analyzed. So that was interesting. And we do have a lot of new colonists we have built 
and reformed our northern medium dome. And now we have plenty of people in here, by the way. Uh, we have 13 unemployed. Why is that? You guys. Oh no, and now we have to oh, do everything by hand again or what? Well then, so we do have one botanist there. Yeah. So we do have this guy, this here, Cassia, Kaisa, botanist. You need to work here and actually do we have oh yeah we now suddenly no one lives here anymore everyone went up here Kaisa Karlsson you move here please and make some babies while you are at it let's work there and yeah suddenly we are we are out of uh, people here again so fit martian born workaholic he's at the space bar hey eh? ah, okay unemployed so here unique you are a youth come on need to work at the bar to make everybody happy you have a nice apartment here that was Monique already yeah it's changing Rico apartments oh, he's working at the space bar eh, what's going on oh. So Monique Jean Alphonse. You also need to go to the space bar. Here, work at the space bar, please. Live in here, please. How many more people? Oh my god. <sighs> and I have to click every time again. So Charles Neumann. He's in the Olympus Hotel, no wonder he's just, you know, hanging out, crashing at the hotel and not doing anything. He's not even writing a novel or something, right? Like pretending to write a novel. There was Charles, then Dimas Polaris, he's an alcoholic and a gambler. So why not? work in the casino right and you go in here and live there because yeah there is space there oh and actually maybe let's go like so and are there actually any engineers maybe unemployed engineers but they're actually all without I wish there were a filter. Like for unemployed people. But it's not here. It's horrible. Horrible. Okay. So then unemployed Charles Dimos. You need to work here. And then I guess you can find your own or maybe maybe go here then. That was Dimos. Unemployed. Theo Erickson. You need to work here. 
live here. Three more slots free. Unemployed. Cyprian Jaeger. We work also here. Because people want to buy some stuff and you live here as well. And by the way, just check it out. So we have one. We have a lot of space in the space bar. Axel Lindberg. Living there, living there. Isaac Elaine working at the space bar, living in this apartment block. Carla Fuchs, she's at least sexy, that's good. Uh, but by the way, why are you not being in treatment? Come on, you've got a co chronic condition. Come on, go there and then the fear, please. They're treating the chronic condition. Carla. You need to be healthy to make babies, my dear. Babies are the only thing, so we have a future. Without babies, there is no future. Oh yeah, and here we need to work there, and then you can live in here. Nice apartment. No babies, no children, there is no future. Alfred Anton. to work there as well and live there please so our senior citizens will be happy uh, if they have some other neighbors i'm sure of it nepomuk an alcoholic so let's stay away from the bar but you also need to work here yeah, so we have a tendency to really destroy the colony because people are moving out of the basic uh, services. And that's really a thing, you know. That's really v way, way worse than anything. So here, come on. So and now things should work out, right? Shouldn't have any unemployed here anymore. Funding received. Four billion. Okay, and so here we do have. How many jobs do we have in this dome? Inspect buildings. Oh. What I would like is, uh, would be to see what is decorations ah. uh, is actually how many, you know, like the, the general thing, how many jobs there are in total and now we have to add it or what. Uh, and hello. Ah, it's the visitors. Okay. So, and what about the jobs? <sighs> Can't see it. Building graphs. Oh, by the way, transportation. No. Buildings. No. What's this? Ah. Oh, the birth threshold is 55 comfort. 70 comfort. 
why is it 70 and for the others oh males who want children females who want children oh the women don't want children here's one homes minus three what does that mean Natch Tigal disabled work sl slots 23 why oh my goodness yeah I'm sorry to say so but I find the the management process in the game is totally horrible children born 11 now we just keep it like this so we'll see we'll see if someone is here I'm just I'm just going here by this one the colonel uh, the unemployed here if there's something so just the general dome thing one unemployed there here three are homeless oh is it the children do we have homeless children that would be horrible no let's have in the entire colony how many children do we have edge group children oh we have a lot of children oh no ufo cassini is uh, in bed oh what is it no functional residence service building was full playing oh poor thing so come on you live you live in here then you have no space in there of course so she's stressed out she's living in the smart home so also smart home and sanatorium smart home it is idle not looking for a job hmm. well then so anyway i think this will it will just take some time or something so guys i hope you enjoyed this episode we made some good progress i think especially on the alien artifact uh, front and that is pretty interesting actually we also research way quicker now by three percent so appear it appears every alien artifact is increasing our research by three and what we will do next now that the rockets are oh, one is back at earth now but that we will do in the next episode uh, we'll have some more stuff yeah it will bring back electronics and then i want actually to have this high speed this high speed com satellite so let's have this one yeah 400 and that will speed up the whole thing here i think so and then after that we'll we'll have this one the city although we already have one right But maybe we can have another one at some point and then i guess in during the next or the the episode after the next one we'll see the the defense system online yeah and then we'll see what's going on so yeah thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it let's appreciate our colony oh and so many shuttles in the air for a second and then actually oh yeah and uh, these guys here are they there yet no not yet where, where are you oh yeah they're driving there okay and then we'll we'll have to flatten it and uh, get to these ones and actually i think it is some t it oh it will be some time yeah that we build uh, actually uh the what is it called like the tunnel or something the infrastructure this one what was it 80 concrete oh yeah but 30 but we can we can actually pay it and then let's yeah we'll we'll build it here i think like here yeah that's a good spot so we'll build it there because here this one will be a, another colony location that's really good with this additional comfort that will be good that will be our baby factory basically F people will feel so happy all they want to do is making love right making love on mars 
The Planet of Love, not War. And then, I think that's actually a good last thought. Let's keep the thought of making love on Mars. And yeah, I appreciate if you click the like button. Uh, thank you for watching. And I, yeah, feel free to join the channel as well if you haven't done so yet, so you never ever miss an episode again. There are the shuttles. Bye-bye, see you next time.